New York Yankees fans, what is up? Yet again, it is Felix from M1News.com. Hola, como estas? Yankees fans, these are the reasons why the New York Yankees are going to sweep the Boston Red Sox. Earlier in the season, the Yankees faced the Red Sox over in Boston. A completely different team. This team you see now is not the same team you saw earlier in the season. Completely different. People might say, oh, but they were projected and predicted to be just a juggernaut in the AL East and win the World Series. No, that team that you saw early in the season was a wild core team. The addition of Andahor, the addition of Torres, has completely changed the dynamic of the 2018 Yankees. As of now, you can compare the New York Yankees to Thanos of Marvel Comics. The Yankees are just unstoppable as of now. The Yankees, I know they're not going to win the same amount of games that the 1998 New York Yankees won, but they are playing at that level right now. I don't see the Red Sox winning a game against the New York Yankees, and I don't see any other team winning a game against the New York Yankees unless they call up Drury and replace him with Andahor and kind of mess up the chemistry that this team has right now. I'm not saying that the Yankees are never going to lose again, but we might see the Yankees become the Golden State Warriors of a couple of years ago where the Golden State Warriors barely lost and just dominated every team that they faced, similar to the 1998 Yankees. Here's a couple of reasons why the Red Sox are going to get swept by the New York Yankees. The New York Yankees do not face Chris Sale. The New York Yankees are going up against, in the second game, David Price. They just own that guy. Maybe they'll have a hard time versus Parcello, but this first game against Pomeranz, they're just going to destroy him. John Carlos Stanton, look for him to have a big game. He's just going to dominate Pomeranz. John Carlos Stanton just dominates those kinds of pitchers. Look for Severino to pitch a great game, a gem. Look for the Yankees to get on board early. It might be even a blowout. Like I said, the Yankees are just going to completely dominate the Red Sox. They have revenge on their mind with that thing that happened with Joe Kelly and Tyler Austin. The Yankees are just going to whip out their belts and give the Red Sox a spanking, literally. They're just going to destroy the Red Sox. They are going to prove that they are the best team in Major League Baseball. And really, the Red Sox are just in their way, and they need to give up that first place spot already. Let the Red Sox compete with the Blue Jays. The Blue Jays might even be a over 500 team. We might see all the AL East teams make the playoffs. We might see the Red Sox make the playoffs, and we might see even the Blue Jays make the playoffs. Let the Red Sox and the Blue Jays fight for whatever wild card spot is available. Don't sleep on the Blue Jays either. With a couple of trades here and there, they're just back in contention. Not that they aren't now, but with a few trades, they could be a deadly team. They have a few players that just destroy good teams. Also, if you've been paying attention, you see the hype of Craig Kimbrough comparing him to uh, Mariano Rivera. Sure, Kimbrough is a great closer, but please stop with the comparisons when it comes to Mariano Rivera. Mo was automatic. He's the greatest closer of all time. And really, we took Mariano Rivera for granted because, like I said, he was automatic each and every time he took the ball. So, if you ask me, Craig, Craigy over there is not going to last. His pace isn't going to last the amount of time it's going to take to catch up to Mariano Rivera when it comes to his save total. So, you'll probably see Kimbrough his demise in a couple of years because if you see how he pitches, is violent. He throws the ball like his arm is about to be detached from his body. So if you ask me, that pace he's on right now is not going to last for a very long time. Sure, he's great, but never, ever compare him to Mariano Rivera. It's almost laughable. So this is why I believe the New York Yankees are going to go out and obtain an ace caliber pitcher come deadline. They just want to bury all these teams. They want to have a comfortable lead and just add one of these pictures that is just going to dominate or help the Yankees continue to dominate teams and just bury 
every MLB team in baseball and certify number 28 for the New York Yankees. So Yankees fans, like always, it has been Felix from NYNews.com and also we have a new site, NYY.news. So check that out, spread it around, and make sure you share, like, and subscribe to this channel.